All right, guys, welcome back to another episode of the Touchdown Podcast, uh, Wrestle Talk Edition. Um, there's been a lot of, you know, news in the wrestling world again with, you know, everything that's been happening with Rhea Ripley returning, you know, Drew McIntyre coming back after his, you know. We're getting screwed, actually. Yeah, getting screwed <laughs> in Money in the Bank. So there's so much to talk about right now. But first of all, um, Cena came out in Money in the Bank, announced his um, retirement. Retirement tour, yeah. Well, that in 2025. Was it was yeah. a while back, but we yeah. were yeah. Yeah. But yeah, yeah. Um, now, because I mentioned that, yes, it was a while back, but what should Cena's um, final ride be? You know, already Miz has said he wants to work with him. Um, seeing Punk wants to go in the ring with him, Randy Orton, The Rock. There's so many things, and I think we're going to see um, a great, you know, ending to John Cena's career. So who do you think, or how do you think the story is going to pan out? Like, who he's going to go back to all the people he's versed with, the Miz, and like, yeah, how do you see it? Yeah, look, look I understand where you're coming from. Like, how you saying about Miz, um, Orton, The Rock, uh, who else is? Uh, Punk. Punk as well. It's going to be tricky. I think Triple H needs to organise an actual proper storyline. If you're going to talk from now on, from SummerSlam all the way down to Mania to the retirement match, um, my head's telling me these two matches. I think he needs to two matches. Two, like I'm saying, like two storylines. He needs to finish it with Randy Orton. The last two, you mean? Yeah. And I think The Rock at Mania. Okay. Retirement match, I reckon. And you got to do the big ones. So, yeah, you got to do the massive so ones. Like I Orton and The Rock. Because he'll be here. Yeah. What would the, be the big one? Because the Miz will be too easy. I reckon. No, I, mean? I reckon. No, but he, he will face the Miz. Yeah, I know, but it's going to be short. Sure. He, yeah. He's going to be here for the rest of 2025. Yeah. So, what's the two big storylines you reckon? Too big. I'm going to map out his whole year. I'm gonna not, not every pay per view, but I'm yeah. gonna say the big ma uh, big pay per views in WrestleMania. You give him Randy Orton, um, Roy Rumble. I reckon. You win I reckon game? Punk. Uh, no, no, no. I, like a match. I want to you give oh, him a, a singles match. match. Okay. Um, I reckon giving Punk at Rumble, Orton at uh, yeah. Mania, and then maybe SummerSlam. You give him. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna say Miz at Rumble, Orton, yeah, Orton at Mania, SummerSlam, Punk. And um and yeah and I reckon in between you give him new wrestlers. You mean SummerSlam for yeah, this yeah. year? Next year. Oh, next yeah, year. I'm saying 2025 yeah, but he's season. saying till no, he's saying until Mania. That's no, it. For the whole no, no, no. The, he said the whole year. Ah, oh, the whole year. So okay, okay. And I reckon in between yeah, yeah, yeah. into the smaller pay per views, you give yeah, yeah. him new wrestlers. Get him to you know pass his knowledge on to these exactly. new new superstars yeah. and see something we haven't seen before. You yeah, know? I, yeah, yeah. So yeah, I reckon um, that's how they should map it out. I think Randy and Cena will verse. Yeah. I think that's the most Mania. obvious one. I think Mania has to. I think. May uh, it could maybe as your point maybe the Rock but no no sorry Rock's got Roman no no that won't work um yes yeah, so I think Randy Orton Cena will happen I think it won't be anyone else because these two have never faced at WrestleMania yeah um together <laughs> and yeah it just be such a you know a wholesome match like you know we've grown up, grown up watching them and just to see them in the ring for one last time it would mm. be just so good um I think seeing Punk will be you know as Bill said in the in part of his storyline. Yeah. Um, but Royal Rumble, I don't know. Do do I see him winning it? Probably. I don't think he'll win the Royal Rumble because, again, I think the Randy Orton is a guaranteed match. Uh, but I would like to see Cena become 17-time champion. Yeah. He, he, win more, he, win more that's yeah, what yeah, I'm yeah. saying. I think that... I think Randy is going to verse Cody Rhodes. I don't know when. It won't be SummerSlam. Probably the next uh, pay per view. Yeah. Pay per view. Uh, so I think Randy will be Cody Rhodes. I'm not saying this is going to happen. This is what I want. People uh, question that. It doesn't matter if Cena wins the, the belt the 17th. It's going to ruin the storyline of what WWE have planned for next yeah, year. That's but right. I honestly think that it's not going to ruin it at all. I feel John Cena, the fans love him and they want to see this last year, this last ride be an, a great one, a great journey. And it produces moments. Like yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's a good so moment. If Randy wants to beat Cody Rhodes, whatever pay-per-view it would be, I think they verse out WrestleMania for the belt. Yeah. Cena wins it, claims his 17th uh, title, makes history. And then later on in the, the years, he'll get his moments against Miz, CM Punk. Maybe CM Punk beats John Cena for the belt because CM Punk's going to be there long term. Yeah. So there's many things you you can really uh, create for Cena to make this a really great ending and great retirement. It's sad, yeah. it's sad it, it, him leaving the company. Yeah, it is. yeah I know. But if it, he's got, the cherry on top will be that 17-time champion. Yeah, to I think it's going to be on the Rick list. Flair, yeah. Rick Flair, Rick Flair, as big of an icon as he was, no one, time. no one was as big as John Cena. Yeah, yeah, was no honestly, one was as big as John Cena. The minute, not Hulk Hogan, the minute, not yeah. The Rock. I wouldn't even see The Rock as bigger than John 100%. Cena. The minute Bro, that he yeah. won the WWE title against JBL at Mania, Everything changed. The whole yeah. thing 
Yeah. In WWE, right. he Six. deserves it, man. Like, he what does. he's done for the company, like, surely show him that respect so, and uh, give him that. He's 17. gonna be twenty twenty the whole year working with WWE. Yeah, twenty twenty five. That's yeah. the final year. And like you see, he's on sixteen, and you see Cody Rhodes on one. Like sixteen, that's so hard to get. Yeah, it is. He's made it all the way, and then to finish at seventeen, man, he deserves it. It's gonna produce such a historic moment. Yeah. Becoming, you know, of course he'll become a Hall of Famer soon. He will, but again, yeah. just to be the most, you know, to hold hold the title 17 times so like I it has to and like I said I, I don't think it's going to ruin it won't. what they have ahead everyone's going to love this moment of seeing them being yeah. the champion again yeah, well, yeah, I, yeah. that's what I think I'm, I'm no going to ask you like a good question like what was your favourite John Cena moment that's out of his one. whole career yeah that's a good one uh, I've got so many of them but I have to you choose go? you go first uh, no, well, you go first oh, I've got okay. so um, much on my head look, I remember that's, on like, the top of fan. my head like there's so many I can't mm. really um, think about one look on the this, again, I might be forgetting so many, but on the top of my head, when John Cena and The Rock WrestleMania. Right now, that's yeah, all I can think about. WrestleMania 28. Yeah. Yeah, that's all I can think about right now. <laughs> what I liked, I know it's just a little moment during yeah. the match, is when he had two attitude adjustment, two plays oh, yeah. on Edge. And was, uh, was it Edge and, show and uh, Edge. Uh, Edge, yeah. That, yeah. I think that was a great moment. That was at WrestleMania 25. Yeah, that was a good the one. The 25th anniversary. Really put me on the spot, eh? This, that was a match. Yeah, I still even, watch that. Even that's Cena a, rapping. Yeah, Thuganomics. Yeah, yeah, I love that. What was the best moment of John Cena? <laughs> Man, bro, you really you? put me on the spot. All right, go, let Bill. Go, 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 Anthony. Go. My moment, uh, John Cena's one. I would say uh, the funniest thing, uh, the funny um, segment that he had with the Vicky Guerrero. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> when, he, when he was um, roasting her, yeah, him that, and Jerry and oh, King yeah, Lawler. Yeah, I remember that. Oh, my God. That, that was the funniest thing. I was dying of laughing, stitches awesome. of laughing, bro. Like, stitches. I could have read. That, that was the first one, but second yeah. one, versus AJ Styles at Royal Rumble. Beating oh, him yeah. out of the 16, you know what? Was the 16 good time, like when as in winning the WWE. The White family in a steel cage and they came around him in the ring. Yeah. And that little kid in front of him, that's another good Bro, one. That's a good moment. Favorite moment. There's probably a lot. There's so many. Of, I'm man. just thinking on the top of my head. What about, what about when he was unveiling the probably WWE the Championship? Saying, yeah. That, that, that was a good yeah. moment. That Smackdown. Good, yeah. Probably the ones I'm saying now aren't my favorite. I'm just yeah. mentioning his yeah. greatest moments. Yeah, I know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to say. It's hard, man. It's hard. So many good ones. I'll get. I'll get back to you. Yeah. I'll get back. I'll get back. Well, look. Yeah. It's. It's good. We're gonna see John Cena for one more time. Like not one off. One on. He's gonna be consistently um, in the WWE. So it's good um, news for WWE fans. Um, But now Drew McIntyre. Um, we've we've seen the situation. (laughs) The situation is going for uh, non-stop um, WrestleMania. Um, uh, money in the bank, and before that, yeah. what was it? Clash, was it Clash of the Castle? Clash of the yeah. Castle. Um. Look, it's not going his way. <laughs> I know. You could start to see that his stream has been unfair now. Yeah, I know. It's it, a bigger plan. Bigger well, plan. That, yeah. That's yeah. what I was saying. I, Drew McIntyre again before he signed a new contract. There was rumors that he was going to leave. Yeah. The contract had stored, and for him to sign that contract, like you said, there's bigger plans for yeah, him. Yeah. I think they promised him promised him something big. And I've said it for many months on the podcast where I believe he deserves a long title reign. Not like Roman, but somewhere around 500, 600 days. He'll be, he'll be a great champion. He, he will he's be, He's so yeah. good, yeah, man. He's he developed so much, him, man. him losing or getting robbed all these times has he's only benefited yeah. his career and his yeah. character. He has to stay heel. He's one of the, he was one of the best heels right yeah. now. Yeah. 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 You know? it's, again, it's going to make him make this title triumph wherever he gets it, you know, worth the wait because- I reckon he probably defeats CM Punk um, he will. at SummerSlam. He will. Yeah, yeah. Then he'll finally get his moment the ne- the next time. And CM Punk. But we don't know when. But we don't know when. Yeah, we don't know. <laughs> it, could we don't know it could be like Survivor Series. Could be Ma- Rumble. WrestleMania. Maybe Mania next as well. They're SummerSlam. cooking something. That's for sure. Triple H has got something. In the I think oven. he's got something planned for him. Like, the, yeah, yeah. We've seen happen. Drew McIntyre back in the past where. I know he's had issues with WWE with the decisions they made. Yeah. And that's surely what McMahon this was is there, the yeah. again, the way he's been treated, I know it's a storyline, but as a wrestler, if he knew things are not going his way, he would not allow this to happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So right. there's yeah, uh, uh, he's gonna get his the, do you uh, think, uh, well, yeah, well, yeah, go No, I was saying about the segment when uh, Adam Peace was like telling him to apologize to the two reps. Yeah. He, did he, did he didn't do that. And he got because he's had enough. Still, yeah, yeah. I wonder what's gonna happen there now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know if Punk because re- they're saying Punk returns he's tomorrow. Ready. Yeah. Okay. yeah so, so if he tomorrow. does return, no, I he's think, coming. He's coming tomorrow. Yeah, I think McIntyre might intervene. They'll start brawling in. I think that's gonna happen. Now, now someone now, that can like, lead the storyline. See some action, like for yeah, him. yeah. yeah oh. Um, but again, on Drew McIntyre's point, um, it'll be good. Do you think he wins it this whole time away to WrestleMania and he wins at that moment to get his WrestleMania right, moment? Oh, at WrestleMania, yeah. nah. You think? No, 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 no. I think as long as it's with a crowd. 
Unlike in 2020 or 20... It'll be a big crowd, you reckon? No, nah, as in, like, remember how we won the title with no crowd? Oh, no so crowd, yeah. yeah. As long as there's a crowd, that ain't, it could happen at all. You know so, what I mean? Yeah. I'll say, okay, yeah. Fair right enough. But, um, yeah, moving on. Now, Logan Paul LA Knight is set for SummerSlam this year. Um, now, the big question is, will Logan Paul drop his US title to LA Knight? Yeah. Um, I think it does. I think, I think yeah. it does. Yeah. I think if it doesn't, it's, yeah. it's unfair. Because if... I'm saying if... He doesn't yeah. drop it. Like if he doesn't lose, Knight, it's, it's unfair. unfair for LA Knight. 100%. Yeah, yeah. Because he's been work- like he should have won Money in the Bank last year. He, he should have won this title before Logan yeah. Paul. Let's be fair. Logan yeah, Paul 100%. again. I, I'm not a fan of champions winning champions and not being there because yeah. growing up I see John Cena with the belt every single week. I see Randy Orton with the belt every single week. Co- coming up, just like Seth Rollins, he was a you know fighting champion. I like those champions. I hate yeah. lo- like I'm not a fan of Logan Paul going on his podcast with that USA belt, yeah. not really coming to WWE once every month. Yeah, like, yeah. I'm, f- I'm not a fan of that at all. Yeah, I, I agree with this as well. Like if you're gonna become a US champion, you gotta defend it every time on SmackDown. Yeah, you know? like John you remember, Cena, like, remember like John Cena, yeah. Bobby Lashley, Rey Mysterio. But let's talk about the bigger picture, man. Yeah. Logan Paul, who just came into WWE recently, or pro wrestling, really yeah, yeah. didn't really fight in the indie scene. You have LA Knight, who's been fighting his ass off, man. fighting tooth and nail yeah. for the past how God knows how many years. Who is the same age as John Cena and Randy Orton, or close to? And Cody who Rose doesn't Hall. even have a singles yeah. title to his name. That's a bad like one. and and the guy who just came in, like this is real talk now. The guy who just came in recently <laughs> has won a singles title before you. Like and 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 say he doesn't drop the title at SummerSlam, yeah. and he, he's. Left with nothing. That's gonna what does that show thing. towards LA Knight? What does that show to those aspiring wrestlers who are yeah. on the come up, who really want to make their name in pro wrestling? That just shows to them that if you got a big name yeah. in the media world, in, yeah. in social media, that that's worth more than you being a great wrestler. Because yeah. even Logan Paul said it. Yeah. He's like, you. Uh, what did he say on on SmackDown that LA you are uh, you? Oh, this is you know no, no no. This is the only thing you have. This is not not the only oh, thing. Oh, yeah. yeah. He's like. I've got a, I've got a platform. I've got a podcast. I'm interviewing, he said everything I'm interviewing yeah. pres- presidents, but he only has pro wrestling. Yeah. So that's just he said it himself. That's a slap so in the face yeah, to yeah, every aspiring pro wrestler, man. I know. He's like trying to make point, a, and he's getting the shortcut as well, Logan Paul. Yeah, like it's he, a big shortcut. It's always his way. Massive. Yeah, massive. yeah you and can't do that. Just, just while he's on Vine, while he was on Vine about ten years ago. LA Knight was was shutting down indie shows yeah, or yeah, shutting yeah. down shutting down bingo halls. They're going from shows to shows, going to country to country, working their ass off and getting paid. And these blokes getting the shortcut when he versus Mysterio, nah, he, yeah, and, he, and won the US title. That's what I'm saying. Like, I respect that. He's backing it up, man. His, his ability. Look, I know he's doing up, well in the right. social media world, but LA Knight has that more experience than him. Yeah, look. Yeah, Logan Paul is very successful. Um, I yeah. don't hate him, but I hate the fact yeah, that I he's know. USA champion before LA Knight and. If he d- if yeah. he s- retains it, yeah. with, there's a big chance he he could because it's at his hometown Cleveland. Yeah. Nah, bro, I'm scared. Go look at Drew McIn- McIntyre. Like, yeah, it can happen. He might lose it, but if he does keep it, then I don't know what what LA Knight. It, it just shows his shortcut, think. okay? But my point is with LA Knight. LA Knight is trying to get his opportunity to get the title because I know what's going to happen after when he wins the title. When he wins that title, he's going to have new, fresh challenges. Uh, all he needs for his career he right needs now, new people that want to his, face him, that his, wants to go for his that. His wrestling title. ability is amazing. Yes. Promo skills is even better. I love now his imagine you slap a belt on him. Wow. How unstoppable will LA Knight yeah. be? Oh, he'll future be world champion, bro. Not oh, he will US. be. He, does he will be a future champion. world champion. Yeah. But, but my point is, my point is, I want him to verse like different wrestlers, like Camilla Hayes. Andrade, uh, who else is? Maybe Ray Mysterio. He's more than a mid carder, yeah. bro. Like he's, he's yeah. He, I think he should be on the top card. Like, he should very be fighting soon. with Cody Rhodes. Yeah, Ana- another so. wrestler that isn't really being treated well is Jey Uso. Yeah. yeah. So is he another one where he's been working hard for so long? Yes, he's had title, uh, title built by his side, the uh, tag teams with uh, Jimmy Uso. But right now he's on his own. He's had many title um, chances and challenges against Damian Priest, against um, Seth Rollins. Sue hasn't got his chance. Now this year he was the favorite to win the money in the bank. Yet again, he fell just like LA Knight. For sure, Is yeah. he in the same situation as LA Knight or will he get that chance Maybe if Damien Priest or Gonta wins yeah. I never, I never got the hype around Jey Uso and I know why yeah. they're not pushing him for that. Bro, like, other than super kicks and a yeet, what has he got? Yeah, I understand Fair that. Point. Yeah. Yeah, I, I Fair agree. point. Yeah, I'll Honestly, like, w- what's... Bro, his promo skills are all right. Like, no, even then, man, he stuffs up a lot of lines and he don't want to say it. But anyways, but like, he's not on the level of LA Knight, on the yeah. level of... Bro, you gotta like he's got the fans behind but him. I'll yeah, tell you that. He doesn't fan. have. The, I don't know what that that effect that effect. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? He, he I, doesn't have. But it's just that. Um, 
I think he's used to the tag team. He's uh, he's a tag team material. Yeah, that's all. And I don't like to bag on wrestlers, but yeah. he's he's he he is and always should be a mid carder, in my opinion, man. Uh, there's there's wrestlers that should never be yeah. in the main event. I know you are calling him main yeah. event Joe, but he. He, I don't. I just don't see it, bro. I don't know I why. Just, it's fair, it's a, you make good like points. Him yeah. so much that you know he's over. It, it might push him to get that belt. Okay, but and like, he can, like, could but you picture him with a world title? Like, honestly, like uh, dead to, set, honest. To be honest, I do. Um, no, like, I, like, I, I, in, I disagree. In what man. way, like, do you see him? Like, how the, like, does he? I don't know. It's confusing a bit. No, 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 like, what do you mean? What do you mean? Like, like in what way? When you say, like, would he win it? Basically. Would he win it? But. I like, say, yeah, but does he suit a world oh, title? I, I think he does suit it for me. I think he can get the fans. He, he I think his promo school is good. It's I, not bad. It's not bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's not bad. He does stuff a few but, lines, but I feel given the belt, and I think he'll step onto another level. I think that's what he's missing in his career. Because when you have that belt, it motivates players. Look how emotional when Damon Priest won that belt in yeah. WrestleMania. And I feel ever since then, he's really stepped up on being his own individual character. He hasn't been relying on a judgment day and he's just been focusing on his own Look, business. But, like, yeah, but yeah. that's the thing, Damien Priest, bro. Yeah, Damien like, Priest. is a world champion. Yeah, but I don't see the same thing with Jey Uso. Yeah, I, I know. But Damien yeah, Priest's level because he had to come through development and then he had to go to. I'm, not talking, I'm not talking about that, but I'm. No, just, I know. I'm saying he, the character. Yeah. I don't like the Jey Uso character. Yeah, I don't maybe, like it either. Maybe it's not my cup of tea. Yeah. But maybe but I just then, never liked it. For me, like, then I feel it's Triple H's fault because why then? Again, Jimmy, I know he was getting old. Their their partnership and that, mm. but why put him on his own? Where World Heavyweight Championship is out of the list for now. United States Championship. I don't think he has a chance right now because it's in SmackDown the, and back, yeah, the yeah. In Intercontinental yeah. Championship. I oh, know, for so Sami Zayn. It's really a waste for him to really just be on his own, not winning any titles, and then a, 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 potentially there's rumors where he might be with Jimmy again. Like, yeah. it doesn't make sense no, for no, that whole year to be on his I, own. I, I agree with you, but I'm just saying my point is I don't think he deserves a war title shot. Okay, I think he needs to go back to with his brother, reunite together because Reigns coming back soon. They need to get back to the tag team division and winning those titles back. Look, I, that, that's my opinion. I, I think from that experience level, he's been there for ten years, 10, uh, yeah. 12 years. Sorry, I think so, he deserves a short stint with the belt just to give him that chance. Like a hope up, yeah. yeah, and just to give because the fans love him. So the fans knowing that Jay Uso has the world title, it will just you know make their love for him even you know better. Because look, um, Shinsuke hasn't he? He's won uh, the. WWE yeah, Shinsuke, has yeah he has the WWE Championship belt. I'm no, he's right. Shinsuke. No, he's only won the Intercontinental. No, I think he has won. He has he's won, won once. No, Interco yeah. Intercontinental. Oh. No, uh, he's won. He's won a champion. Oh, yeah. He did. Uh, 2017, no. I think. Didn't Roman beat him? Did he not? No, yeah, AJ check. Styles de defeated him twice. Well, anyway, let, let's shut before Shabba. Let's say he has been WWE Champion. That may, And he, he wasn't it for long. That's my point. I think give Jay- Was it? Or? Yeah, he was. Yeah, he oh, was. Give Jay Uso just a short reign. Let him have it, but it's too late now. His brother's coming back. Yeah, so exactly. I, I think that's out of the Wait, book, out nice. of the question. Um, look, but like I'm saying about what's say for Jay Uso. Look, if Triple H was going to give him a good storyline to win that world title. Oh, no, sorry, he hasn't. Oh, yeah, he hasn't. That's okay. all I told yeah, you. Right. That's a big Mandela effect. He, he, he tried to be. He <laughs> you, know, to, you know what a Mandela he, effect is when you think something happened, yeah, but it yeah. didn't happen? But he tried to be. He tried to be. He tried to be. I know they had the best matches of the of a lifetime, but he felt short. Yeah, uh, Shinsuke. That's when he went Hilton. Look, we're talking yeah. about wrestlers that don't, yeah. like they're not getting what they want. Who are, say one wrestler, which wrestler do you feel besides the one we've mentioned that deserve more and, and why? Mm, and uh, they should get okay. like a title shot I'm, and that as well. Yeah, like I'm they deserve more than what they're getting at this current it's hard. stage. It's Randy, hard. Randy Orton. Yeah, that's a good one. Randy Orton, why? All right, man, he's helping out all these superstars, ro locker room leader, as they, yeah. they like to call Randy Orton. But I feel like him still being loyal to this company yeah. and him still sitting around, not not recently. I know he's got that feud with the Bloodline and Cody Rhodes or whatever. Yeah. But as of recent, somewhat in that mid-card level, you know, I know he had that sting with RK Bro not too long yeah, ago. Yeah. With Matt Riddle, yeah. You know, he's been with Kevin yeah, Owens. Yeah. I know he's coming off an injury, yeah, blah, yeah. blah, blah. But he's still sitting around that middle part of WWE programming. But I feel like this guy should always and sh should always be at the top of yeah, WWE. Definitely. He should always be fighting for world titles, which I think he will um, in the future with Cody Rhodes. Yeah. Yeah. But right now he deserves it, man. And I could make an argument that he deserves um, the most amount of title, uh, Cena. Uh, most right. amount of titles that John Cena. I could make that he's argument. On 13 yeah. He's 14. on 14. 14. fourteen. No, he's fourteen. Yeah. So I could make the argument, but I feel like out of all the superstars right now in WWE, it's your LA Knights, Jey Uso's, Damian Priest, you name them, 
it should be Auden at the top of that list that should yeah. deserve more. What about because he's leading the pack? Yeah. What, what, what about the fresh faces? Like the Randy Orton yeah. is good because we haven't seen like, ever since Randy returned. We haven't seen him be Randy. Yeah, you know, ruthless, the Hilton, Yeah, you know, dangerous. And again, him being at the top will make WWE even better because you got um, Damian Priest who's up the top right now. Drew McIntyre. You got um, Cody Rhodes. So if he's up there, as Bill said, he's right in the middle right now. Yeah. But if he he's up there, we will start because to see the, the old way Randy. the way. I'm seeing it. I don't know if the wrestling fans. Yeah. Are no, no, it. yeah. The way I'm seeing it is, they're they're treating him as uh, almost as if like his career's done. Okay. He, he'll never get a world title opportunity yeah, yeah, yeah. or never, you know, you know, get it, get into that main event spot again. But I feel like there's still a lot left in that tank for Randy Orton. He does, yeah. He's still he's still pretty. He's young. He's man. Like, How old is he? He's only forty one, I think. 41. Yeah, man. He's, he's still already, he's, he's still not, still he's still on the like old side. He's already yeah, yeah. that he want to say long because you yeah. remember when he returned, he said ten years. And and, yeah. he, and he's like, like he's I feel like, even better than I was in my thirties because yeah. of his yeah. back fusion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like, he, give him. But I think they they're gonna give him the belt. It's very. I think they are. Once he turns heel on Cody, his whole story career. His career will change again. Hundred He'll start yeah. to be on his own, yeah. not caring about anyone. Doesn't want to be partners with anyone. He's yeah. just focused on him because, again, he's been too much with people helping yeah. people. So and I, I guess I agree. That's like it's a locker room leader. That's yeah. that's yeah. what it is. I, yeah. I think he's now yeah. like the locker locker room future leader now. Yeah, yeah. No, he's, no, the he's the leader. Yeah, I know. One hundred percent. Like, yeah. so yeah. take it over. Which that's wrestler it. do you want? I'm still because my one was LA Knight at the yeah. start. Um, le- le- Anthony, what do you think? Oh, man, there's so many out there, man. It deserves a lot. Look, or, I agree with Auden. Like, I'll, I'll take Auden as well, hundred percent. Okay, but I think, you know what? I'm gonna give Braun Strowman because now Braun Strowman returned. Okay, yeah. I think he deserves it. Like, I think he needs to get pushed a bit more. Um, I know he's gonna probably join the Wyatt Six very soon, so I think it will deserve him uh, in that material level, like becoming that black sheep again. And I think he should go for the world title shot. Okay. So I'll, yeah. I'll say Braun Strowman. I'm saying Street Profits. Oh, okay, yeah. Okay, I think Street yeah. Profits, they've been just quiet, man, on the side. Yeah, not they've doing been that silent, yeah. Uh, you, you said a period, I think it was two years ago, or were they in COVID time? Yeah, they, yeah, they yeah, were, they yeah. Were, they were doing quite they good were, in yeah. uh, COVID time. But ever since then, I don't know, WWE haven't really been focusing on them. I think they're good wrestlers. Uh, their promo school isn't the best. I think they're still new to the wrestling, yeah. and eventually they'll get better at it. But yeah, I feel they deserve to have a title shot. They haven't had that in years. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, I feel they've worked hard. They're, they're good wrestlers, like I said. And it's about time that maybe they get a chance at DIY as well yeah. or either, what's it called? Um, JD and- can I, cha- can I change mine? Like, yeah, go, I, I just, yeah, go, go. Um, the, the new bloodline, you know, Tama Tonga and uh, Tonga Loa. But you they just came in. They just came in. Yeah, but, uh, you can't you really say You know what? I'm going to put Jacob Fatu. They were getting pushed, but- Jacob Fatu, no, I think he will get the push because I know he wants to be on his but own. But they just recently debuted, so you couldn't yeah, really know, say that. he's going to get pushed very soon. What, what has he done to deserve it? To right deserve, now? deserve it right now. No, like he's so dangerous and he's- but deserve he's get, it, but- He gets the hype now. Like everyone knows bro, he's going to be yeah. there. When you say deserve, like yeah. put on five-star matches for the past five weeks. I think he will deserve five-star matches because- I know. I'm saying he's hit like right now, where he is right now. Yeah. He hasn't accomplished hasn't nothing, bro. He's never yeah, won he a hasn't, title. Yeah. Hasn't had a banger match. Three weeks he just has a banger character right now. You yeah. can't really, he des- you can't really say he deserves yeah, anything yeah. right now. That's yeah. what I'm trying I, to say. I can say the tag team. Maybe I, in te- two months, three months maybe, time, yeah. who knows? Yeah. But I'll, I'll stick with the bloodline, the Tama okay. and that. Right, Cause okay. they're gonna get yeah, the title yeah. shot. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's gonna I'm happen. It's gonna happen. You should have just kept that as Strowman, buddy. I know, it's all right. I'm gonna go Chad Gable. Yeah, I had a feeling Again, had his moments and now he's linking up with the Creed Brothers. brothers. But again, he he did get disrespected and it even showed up in his character how he turned heel on Sami Zayn. He's just had enough. He's had so many chances. And I would, um, I don't think, I don't think he'll come after Sammy right now, but again, I see him one day even being world champion, Chad Gable. But mm. right now he deserves more. He deserves a title. But right? uh, yeah, Done. that's how, that's Wrestle it. Talk. That's it. It's done. Wrestle Talk's done. done for this week. That was a big calm. T- this one was calm. No, it's calm. Yeah. Uh, um, guys, you're new here. Hit that like button. Why is it so awkward? Hit that like button. <laughs> hit subscribe. Comment down below. What, what's happened? Does it, do you want to change your- No, no, no. <laughs> you want oh, no more it? changes? Oh, I'm fine. You want to change your wrestler? Oh, no, no. yeah, yeah, yeah. Go one more. Go one, one more in the more. bank. No, no. If I can change it. <laughs> if, if you can change it. Are you going to cash it in? Put Are someone for, cash oh, someone? Hey, hey, put someone from NXT. Yeah. Hey, they deserve it. Yeah. But anyways- Michael Cole deserves more. <laughs> <laughs> I reckon Pat McAfee. <laughs> <laughs> what about Snoop Dogg, man? He's he's always Snoop Doggy though. <laughs> Anyways, Anyways yeah. you're new here. Oh hit that like God. button, subscribe, comment down below. We'll catch you guys in the next episode.